YouTube. What's up, Raider Nation? This your boy LB. I'm back once again. I know y'all miss me. Another YouTube video. I know y'all see them waves, man. I know y'all see them waves. Hold on, let me, let me show. Let me show them off for y'all right quick. But yeah, your boy's back. But in this video. I want to give a motivational speech and some and some advice so basically the reason why I'm doing this topic but hold on Raider Nation I got a video for y'all too I have a special video for you for y'all as well so I'm gonna be I'll be back with my Raider videos real soon but I feel like I need to put my opinion out there because is this always a topic on social media? Relationship goals, love, marriage, God, all the stuff like that, man. Stuff like that. But people want to know what is true love and how do I know when I found the one? How, how do they know they found the one? But basically, true love is... something that is real something that is not fake something that is godly something that is from God true love is patient true love is kind true love have no remembrance of wrongdoing true love do not embrace in evil true love has no pleasure in evil True love is godly. God is love. And love is kind of patient. True love. You, you actually know when you truly love somebody and you are truly loved. Because when you feel like that you are truly loved, you feel heartwarming. Your spirit will know it. Your soul will know it. Everything about you will know it. You want it. You wouldn't be confused because God is not the author of confusion, and God is love. Remember what I said now. God is not the author of confu confusion. Anything sent sent from you from God will come with confirmation. Anything that is sent to you from God will come with confirmation. Remember, remember that. Remember who told y'all that. Your boy LB. Anything that is sent from God will come with confirmation. Because if a guy say he love you, but he beating on you and fighting you, cursing you out, and bruising you, calling you names, verbally abusing, militantly abusing, emotionally abusing you, is that from God? No, that's not from God. That person do not love you. Because somebody who loves you is going to protect you, care for you, have your back, empower you, help you grow, encourage you, and motivate you to be better. That's how you know you're truly in love. A person who loves you, truly love you, will pray with you, pray for you, help you heal, just help you. They will put their needs to the side and put your needs before they needs. That's the person who truly love you. A person who truly love you will show you from their heart. A person who truly loves you will actually give you the best of them. And it go both ways, vice versa. They go for both men and women. But that's basically what true love is, man. I can't explain it no better. That's what true love is. True love comes from the heart. True love is shown through action, just not from their mouth. But, but don't worry, it's pretty boy. But I was saying, man, I hope this message helps help somebody today, because a lot of people out here need to know. Know your worth. Know that you are great. Know that you are kings and queens. Know that you are royalty, man. 
Know that you are royalty. Don't settle for anything. Don't shorten yourself when you can actually have what you deserve. Why settle for? Why settle for? How can I put this? Why settle for a boyfriend that's not loving you when you have a guy over here that want to be your husband and he'll give you anything you want, anything you need, everything you deserve? Why settle for a boyfriend when you can have that husband? And the goal is to get married. You understand what I'm saying? You feel me? Why settle for a girlfriend when you can have that wife who won't go out here and cheat on you? Well, Alright, I'm done. I ain't gonna preach to y'all today. I ain't gonna preach to y'all for hours and hours and hours. But I'm gonna preach. I'm gonna preach to y'all today. I'm gonna preach to y'all today. Well, Alright.